What's up everybody, Derek here, and today I'm at Bass Pro Shops, and we're going to go through some boats up here. I was recently asked a question by one of my subscribers about what is the best boat for a beginner. And you could go to the low end of the spectrum to where you go get something off of Craigslist or Facebook Marketplace, and you pay a really low amount for a used boat that is exactly what you need. Or if you feel like you need something somewhere in between, something right in that middle price point, that's what we're going to be looking at today. Or if you want to buy something new, you're basically buying a warranty, which is going to be about $15,000 and up. So if you go from a $500 John boat you got off of Craigslist to a $15,000 brand new boat with all the bells and whistles and all the upgrades that it's going to have, find something in between there. So that's what we're going to look at today is bare bones boats where you can upgrade it yourself. You can put your trolling motor, your outboard. I've got another video on the outboards that Bass Pro has. So these boats are actually awesome. And for me being a DIY kind of guy, these are the kinds of boats that I would actually be looking at. If I want to have something that I'm going to build, I'd have so much more more oh, appreciation for it in the end because i know that i put it together and i built it the way that i wanted but let's go through these boats because i still have a warranty on the haul and everything else these are grizzly boats the one back there has the motor and everything already on it but these right here do not have a motor on them they're bare just down to the metal and that's about it with the trailer so you're getting what you pay for as you're seeing we'll look at them here in a second but let's look at this one for example first it's a 2020 grizzly 1860 uh it's got a four stroke 90 on it with a custom trailer so 19 gallon fuel tank 23 foot long at fully long with the outboard seven foot beam it's 2,000 pounds roughly the whole thing and it holds up to seven people that is crazy seven people can fit on this boat for $22,000 it's a pretty sweet boat now imagine what you could do if you could take the price down with one of these and upgrade it as you go along as putting in an outboard or trolling motor or whatever you want so let's look at this one right here this one's about a foot shorter than that fully rigged tracker over there a grizzly over there um, this Grizzly is 17 foot one. It can hold a 50 horsepower. It's got a 6.6 beam and it's 1380 pounds and it can hold six people as well for $6,000. That is crazy. So if you got you a trolling motor, mounted that thing up. If it was a 24 volt, you're basically spending about $200 on batteries and you're ready to go fishing. So basically, you tack on another thousand dollars to that right there and you're looking at about seven to eight thousand dollars to get out and go fishing and have something that has a haul warranty and then later on you could put an outboard on it and here's an 18 foot one which is basically the same thing as that grizzly that's back there it can hold a 60 horsepower seven foot beam 1600 pounds and this one can hold eight people now that's crazy and it's actually less price yeah six thousand dollars whereas this one is a little bit shorter and it's the same price that's crazy let's come over here and look at this one this one looks like it might be the same size yeah it's the same boat all right now let's look at this one it's a little bit smaller this is the 16 foot one can hold a 40 horse it's a six foot beam 1260 pounds total and it can hold four people for a little bitty boat like this and they're very simple it's just got a hatch right here and all of this underneath is all storage you've got tons of room for rod lockers and this thing i have got to say is super wide all of them are super wide they're just shorter so they're all going to be basically about the same as you can see four people for a 16 and this 18 eight people as it says right there and this is a big boat i'm kind of surprised they don't allow with this transom a little bit bigger motor than what it's actually rated for but now if you want to even go down further i do not have a price on this 
but I believe most of these, this is a Topper Tracker 14, which is just a John boat. It's not the same as those other, other Grizzlies, but most of these are about $1,000 to $2,000. The cool thing about these is you can actually get you a $200 um, dollar trolling motor for the most part and slap it right on the back back there with one battery and you're gone and you're out fishing. Just so simple, these things. They can get you out. And in a 14-footer, as wide as that one is, you could fish just about everywhere. And as far as in weight, it does. I don't have the specs, but look at this. I could probably pick that thing up over my head. Of course, it'd be a workout, but... And they make 12s, they make 10s. I mean, just great ways to get out on the water, so... I don't know. This is probably the best way if you want to have a warranty right in the middle to upgrade as you go. To have a warranty and have an awesome boat that holds up a bunch of people. But I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments section. I'd love to hear from you guys and kind of your take on some of these boats. Or if you have better ideas than what I've got for this one right here because... I've always admired these boats and I've actually got a jet John and this would be a great platform to put a jet ski engine in or a jet outboard or anything like that because these things would rip as light as they are but let me know what you guys think in the comments section I'd love to hear from you guys and thanks for watching and subscribe if you haven't already like this video if you like it and I'll see you guys in the next one.